So we can upgrade a uh, hundred gold or a rare relic. Um, a rare relic. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a weird path. I should have went to the bus. You're right. You're right. I have the option not to fight. What's up, reloading? I had the option not to fight. I should have taken that option. If that was a smart dad, I'd be like, hmm. This is double thorns and a burn bro. Burns clog my deck and thorns kind of ruin my win condition. I'll pass. Okay, no, hindsight's 2020. But when you have the option to skip a fight and then you die to the fight that you took, you gotta feel like a bonobo. I mean, you have to sometimes feel like a bonobo. My name's Christopher Walken, and sometimes I uh, feel like a bonobo because I make these plays and I'm thinking to myself, like, did I? I don't care. I have a terrible Christopher Walken impression. Never doing that again. Who didn't think that far ahead? I know, right? Who's got time for that? Blade dance? That's I, my first time ever trying Christopher Walken. My first time ever trying it. I, I, I picked up some speed along the way. I've never been the kind of guy to do impressions, so I'm kind of practicing a little bit. Oh, my bad. Uh, what are you hoping to build? Um, I'm hoping to get... Just some solid cards. I can't really... I'm always hoping for, like, some ninja shenanigans. That's always my hope and dreams. But, um... I can't really force anything. I just gotta let the cards come to me. That ought to get some attention. Christopher Walken played. That would be cool. Christopher Walken plays for this fire. I'm not liking these cards. Not at all. You just begin to see some really bad stuff, guys. I, I'm tempted to buy accuracy, guys. I'm tempted to buy the damn accuracy. The prepared is not bad because we have tough bandages, but it's not upgraded. It would need to be upgraded. And upgraded is six block for f zero. Not bad. I would, but what? But I, I want to waste an upgrade on that. I don't think so. On load. Mmm. Mmm. Can we get some, uh... Can we get some points to, um... To duck? I'll leave one gold, alright? The mess is not worth it. Let's give some points to duck. For that nice call out. But it's also blame duck if we lose. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. How do, we, how do we feel about eviscerate unload combo? Horrible, right? Tough bandages. Whenever you discard, you gain three block. That's why I got unload. Discard deck. I like that combo. The problem with this combo, guys, let me explain what's wrong with this combo. Is that you need to have eviscerate and unload in your hands. And then unload needs to be played 
preferably alongside skills, so there can't be as many strikes alongside this. And then that has to be a good enough play, whereas it's either doing lethal damage or something, or their block is sufficient from the discard that you feel okay doing it. In which case, neither of those things are true. Then you have Unload and Eviscerate as curses in your hand. Which is why we do Deflect. Now, I don't usually give Insight Bites, but I need to give Insight there. Alright? Because it's clear as day. Boom, boom. But now you want me to be a mad lad. Oh, now you want me to be a mad lad. I wanted to do unload, but I resisted. What do we do unload now? Oh, jeez. Look at unload, baby. Boom, boom, smack daddy. Let's go. So there's time to place to be a mad lad, but if I'm a mad lad in Act 1, then what's going to happen is I'm not going to get out of Act 1, which right now is the case. We're not getting out of Act 1. I'll tell you what, guys. We are not getting out of Act 1 right now. Bum, 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 bum. Unload is giving me some value, though. Alright, there's that to look forward to. Bum, 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 bum. We did it. The only reason why we're so low in life, just remember, guys, that, ooh, Storm of Steel is kind of crazy with tough bandages, isn't it? Wow, 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 wow. Fill this damn mug cup. Yeah, hell yeah. So, look at that. Oh, yeah, fill that cup. Now, Storm of Steel is interesting with tough bandages, but Dash is just so good. So now you call him Iron Chad, but on the thing, I recommended Iron Chad. I was like, man, Iron Chad is the name. Then, but you put on Reddit, you put the Chad clad. I was like, Chad clad? I like both. I like both. You feel like I'm getting little bitties. You gotta show your bitties. Hey, Valderick, thanks for the follow, buddy. Um, damn, Valderick. I've seen you a long time. You just dropped a follow. I'm gonna ignore that. Yeah, but I think Dash is just more solid, honestly. Because you need, you need to have a nice open hand for Stormer Steel. It's the same kind of problem where it's like, you need to have, this needs to be a good play to discard and do, I don't know, it's just Dash is better. It's just better. Maybe I'm wrong, but Calipers. Bag of Marbles. You could go for a shop. Backflip, Dodge, and Roll. I really like Dodge and Roll. I think Backflip helps unload a little bit though, right? Because backflip makes unload potentially a little bit bigger. It would have been nice for Storm Steel as well. Backflip. Alright, Sin. Thank you for the biddies, man. Thank you for the biddies. I appreciate your biddies. You don't gotta worry about giving me more biddies. I mean, give me all the biddies, but you gave me a good amount of biddies. Some really good art, man. It's really good art. That's a really fine girl on the top one. Man, that the butt on the top one. Man, wow. Wow. Uh oh, that's ironclad. Ah oh, shit. I beat it again. It happened again. I think calipers is pretty good, actually. I think calipers is pretty good. Oh, 100 bitty, thank you, man. Thank you for the 100 bits. Appreciate it. Drop it into the cup. Bam. Smack. You just did a, you just did a body slip of bits. Pog champ right there. Uh, Jacor, how you doing, man? So we got backflip again for more card draw and potentially discard in the future. Cloak and dagger, which is obviously very nice. And they're prepared, which is pretty good as well with tough bandages and calipers, right? So if we do enough prepared and we don't go against time leader or whatever, or the chosen... We can keep preparing, get a lot of free block, calipers. Hmm. I like prepared, I just wish it was upgraded. Boom, 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 boom. Let's do it. Prepared, baby. Let's go. Boom, 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 boom. 
didn't you think it was last jam play and it's amazing how they recommend it oh man i'll check it out i like dave Grohl. what's nice about unload is that if i had shuriken or, or kunai there i could do three attacks and still get nice block it's like a, a little ori in its own way it's cool Another backflip. They really want to give me these backflips, huh? I think Poison Step would be better for damage, right? A little bit. Alright, let's see what happens. I don't... Eviscerated and Chops, which means... That's the lag of Olin, yeah? I'm feeling lucky. I'm not feeling lucky. I, I lost. I fucking lost. Oh my god. This is the end. Oh my god. Why are you doing this to yourself, Jeremy? I should have played couch ups earlier, guys. I should have played couch ups earlier. It's getting down to the wire. I should have played couch ups on the earliest of earliness. Backflip into unload. Oh, we got dash versus unload. Dash is good. Oh, this is 11 damage. That's 11 damage plus 4. He kills himself. But do I survive is the question. That is 11 damage, my friend. But do I survive? I don't. Because I need to, I need to basically have. I don't survive if I do that. Can we do this? Can we do this? It's all about the draw right here. All about the draw. Oh my! You're shitting me. Did I just fuck it up? Did I just... Uh, I did the math wrong. No, defend on low would be bad because... If you defend... Defend, I had no dexterity, so I actually wanted to discard with on low for drop vantages. But, I thought Shiz was doing two. I was doing one. I had a feeling I should have drawn first because I wanted to look for like better cards, but I first I did them the shivs I was I looked I looked at the truck, I was like, okay, so if the strike is three, the shivs is like two, right? But I forgot that shivs do four, strikes do six, so Yeah. I wanna save scum so bad. I wanna save scum so bad. So bad. People are gonna judge me. I'm never gonna live it down. I gotta accept the loss of command, right? I gotta be a man about this. See, the vocal people in the chat, right? They're the minority, but the majority is watching and shaking their head like, if you do that, Jeremy, many people will be disappointed. I say, fuck it. Oh, now, what if I do couch ups first? How different would the fight would be? Cause I, what I did was I got a big calipers. What if I do couch ups right, right out of the gate? It's gonna make the fight different. 100%. 100% different, but I'm curious.
Thank you, big buddy. Take the bits, you say he's gonna. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the biddies. Now, this fight's going a little bit different because I played couch ups earlier. We'll see if that makes a difference. Bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum. bum. I can do survivor and get cal calipers, or I can go damage to the face. I feel like this run's going worse. Just a feeling. Ooh, we got we got some stuff. Why is it doing worse than before? I watched last time. Pog champ. Pog champ. Okay. Prepared again? No, last time I didn't play calipers. Uh, couch ups first. Couch ups first. I played couch ups first. So last time I, what I did is I got survivor dash. But I got couch ups out of the way. So I do more damage with couch ups over time. And it wasn't in the cycle. So that was better. Um, we got Dagger Spray Choker prepared. Prepared again for discard synergy, but again, they need to be upgraded. Uh, whereas Dagger Spray is not bad for AoE, but damn it, I'm going full YOLO. I want the damn synergy, and I want it now. But Jamie, think of the children. What do they have to do with it? Bum, bum. I mean, this is good calipers heavy. Damn. This is uh, quite the questionable run so far. If we can get some good upgrades, get some, you know, we can turn this around. That's a lot of block, guys. If I do unload, that's a lot of calipers. I mean, that's a lot. Not to mention, that's 20 damage. Now, we can do this and get even more draw for unload, or we can just do this. Bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. I could have done the math to see which one's better, actually. Um, oh, that sucks. Might be. <laughs> How's the idea of the ad video? The ad video, I like the idea. I like the idea of going to ad video. I also do Patreon and stuff. Survivor was better there. Because Unload didn't give as much of uh, Gallopers. I, I, Survivor was better. Because he had block. If he didn't have block up, then Unload was better. But since he had block, Survivor was better. Deck is kind of spicy. It's getting, it's getting there. Deck is getting kind of spicy. It's getting kind of... Uh, like there's a little bit of picanteness coming through. You know what I mean? Like I, I can almost... I'm smelling the cayenne pepper coming through. There's uh, some, uh, some jalapeno on the left. A little bit of black pepper in the middle. Somebody put a little cinnamon on top. I was like, hmm, I'm smelling the spice a little bit. It's, uh, it's simmering. It's about to burst. It's about to burst. Jeremy, you're playing a game. You're not cooking. Listen. Yeah, man. Calipers and um, bandages is a great combo. Simmer the spire. 
coming soon to a store near you. You too can learn how to swim this spider like I do. Using the freshest ingredients. And the freshest cards. Oh, cow traps is pretty good, man. You know, cow traps is pretty good. Uh, be right back in a second. I'm gonna... Tell me what card you guys want to see. I'll be right back. Alright, guys. We got the coffee. We got the coffee in the cup. We are ready to go. Now, what did you guys choose? Am I coming back? No, I just decided to stream. Open up the stream. And just never come back. I literally know what I did. I got off. I went across the country. I'm not coming back, guys. Um, how you doing, Zoom? So, how's the poll coming along, guys? Let's, uh, let's take a look at the poll real quick. Oh, you gave me that poll. That's cool. You guys want Nightmare. I don't agree. Fine. Okay, let's do this, though. Alright, let's get some boats going. Alright, we get Coffee Dripper. You can no longer smith. Oh, you can no longer rest. That's dangerous. But I like living on the edge. Nightmare's gonna be a curse. By the way. FYI. Nightmare's gonna be a curse. For the most part. Well. Until it's not, of course. I might as well just do it now, right? On Deflect. Get a big old smack of Deflect. But then that's gonna make the future turns kind of worse. And that's no bueno. Yeah, I took Coffee Dripper. Hell yeah, I took Coffee Dripper. You got a problem with that, buddy? This is awkward. This is like a Mexican standoff, guys. Who's gonna win? Unload or Survivor? Who's gonna get to be played? I can Survivor this and then unload. Boom. That's fine. Give X a chance? Um, yeah. At some point. It's not necessarily on my radar at the moment. But definitely. I mean, there's other games too, right? We do have... I mean, those are the games that I've kind of been playing recently, so... I like those options. But obviously, there's a lot of games I can play. This guy's a son of a gun. No, man, S2 is not Resident Sleeper, bruh. You stop that right now. Ooh, leg sweep. Who's the boss? How are we killing this guy again? I'm not sure yet. Yeah, guys, we haven't done chess in a long time. My favorite opening in the chess is uh, Rui Lopez. I love the Rui Lopez. I am Rui Lopez, light, ride or die. I haven't played chess in a while. Error 9 thinks SC2. Oh my god, everybody's hating on SC2. Come on, guys. Don't break my heart like this. It's so basic. Okay, we'll make it a little less basic. I like... I mean... There's only a couple... Like, if you're talking openings, right? There's... There's... There's, there's like... Two main openings, alright? Maybe K3. There's E4. There's D4. For white. Right? Now, if you're going D4, you're probably looking at the Queen's Gambit, those kind of things. If you're going E4, you're probably doing the Rui Lopez. And you can do other, like, the, the King's Gambit and, like, some, some uh, Marshall thing, whatever. There's there's some other stuff you could do. I just nightmared that. That was a mistake. Uh, and if you're on the black, you can open up, uh, you can defend with a Sicilian, or you can defend with a Knight's Indian or whatever. Or just a basic King Keto. Um... I mean, yeah, the Lipis is basic, but it's my favorite. It's been a while, though. I used to, I mean, I'm sure back in the day, I used to have, like, like a... How many prepares can we get, by the way? So, if I get prepared... Let's keep doing it. I used to have, like, some special tricks I would do. Like, I, I, I used to do D4 and, like, Queen's Game and stuff, and I used to really like that, but... I kind of just like the Rui Lipis. I didn't want to go this path. I wanted to skip the Elite. Uh, didn't realize there's an Elite right here. I'm probably dead. Wait, what? Oh, that's a monster. For some reason, I thought that was an elite. My brain is... ...seeing things.
Hmm. Sneaky strike. Karakon, I always suggest new players. Yeah, I don't like the Karakon. I like, uh... I like the King's Indian as well. But, uh, I have, I'm so out of practice that really I, I just kind of know E4 and C5 as my openings. I guess those trades are not bad, right? Yeah. The London for white. Yeah, these are all these things that people love. Like they, people always like stand by the. I guess it's like it's like the, the new meta of chess openings. It's like the Karo Khan, the London. There's also what's it called? It's the unbreakable. There is a um a particular line in the Sicilian that's kind of unbreakable called the. What's it called? It's Kramnik loves to play it. Pfft, I discarded the card that I wanted to use. Oh my god. When I'm talking about chess, I'm thinking about things and I'm not actually focusing. I blame you guys. It's very in vogue. Let's skip here. Let's do this, actually. Thirty-five. Yeah. I I was so distracted. I think I just took way more damage than I needed to, and I probably lost the run just right there. But uh, which is fine because we what, what game did we choose, guys? What game did we choose? We're not we're not done with uh, so this part yet, but let me see. Oh, SE... Oh, they're all tied. So you guys like SE2. But you guys, a lot of you guys are not voting, though. The proportion of votes are kind of low. What's chess? Chess is like a... It's a new game. That all the young folks are playing. I don't recommend it. It's just a hip new game. Um, a lot of graphics required. Don't even try to buy it. Like, if you don't have a high-end computer... It's super competitive, too. Like... Kind of toxic. Like I, I played chess the other day on like a special computer that my friend lent me, and like the guy BM me after I won. Okay, I I need to learn to cut these jokes. All right, guys, let's uh, get this coffee going. Ready for the next leg. <laughs> beta. The fact that you said that, so matter of fact, it just caught me off guard. It caught me off guard because you... To me, when I read what you said, Beta, it almost like sounded like a, like a legit request. As opposed to like the BM that we were talking about. So <laughs> it sounded like some guy was trying to solicit something out of you. Sorry, that just kind of... The way you said that, Beta, kind of threw me off guard. Oh, shit. Yeah, that got me a chuckle out of me. <laughs> shit, are we dead, guys? Hey, you're probably too old, too old to have heard about chess. Uh, if you're, if you're like, born before the year 2000s, you probably haven't heard about chess. I only heard about chess because, like... I, uh, I went to revisit my old high school, and like, I happened to walk into a room when they were playing it, and I was like, oh, it's a whole, a whole new rage or whatever. But if I didn't walk into that room, I probably would have never known. So don't feel bad about it, like, it's kind of obscure. Who knew the way to get some actions to get good in chess? Well, you know who knew that? 
Magnus Carlson, and there's another guy. You guys need to know. Uh, you guys, his name is. He draws a lot. When I say this, wh whoever knows chess in this audience is gonna know what I'm talking about. He draws a lot. He is the king of drawing. People always knock on him for being Giri. There you go. Boom. Giri met his wife. Good chess. Oh, guys, we can't rest. Oh, my God. Yep, Gary. Gary, good Gary. We can't rest. We got a dream. Shanzo, were you the one that beat me in chess or something? Somebody beat me in chess because I messed up and I made a blunder. I need to redeem myself, all right? Nightmare is a curse, but we're going to go ahead and just do deflect and hope for the best. Bam 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 Calipers is gonna save the day. Cal I don't have no damage. If I had damage to make up for the fact that I have sh shit off or everything else, then okay, it's fine. But I got no damage to boot. But give you got some calipers, all right? Something. And we'll do some chess. We'll do some chess. I haven't played. Ch I I got really rushed in chess, and I I lost some face the other day. And I let um. I let some of my viewers beat me. All right, and that's unacceptable. Calipers, I believe in you. Is this gonna be a three HP dream? I believe. Oh my god, prepared. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. Are we doing it? Is it happening? Oh boy. You know what I need now, guys? More than anything in the world, this shop has to have a waffle. Can we get some RNG in the chat? Bless RNG for a waffle. Please, almighty G R N Jesus, give us a waffle. Hallow be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Courier is here. Oh my, this fight. I'm not hopeful. I am not hopeful about this one. Nightmare Adrenaline wasn't bad. You know what? Nightmare prepared. Bam. Save the, save the day. Ooh, I don't know about this one. So, Caltrops, I mean, Cal Caltrops just start killing them. Right? Let's keep going. Let's weaken this dude. Let's see what happens. No? No, Bonifar, you, you make jokes? That's it, you gotta live with your jokes. Alright, cause we had to live with your joke. So, no, it's done. It's done. You, you fucked up. You got, we gotta live with it, you gotta live with it. That's it, it's over. Um... Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I think we can do this, guys. I mean, should I should I dare to dream? Should I dare to dream right now? Should I dare to dream? I dreamt a dream of time gone by. Bum, 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 bum. I never knew the music. So different now from life I'm living. So different now from how it seems. I dreamed a dream of life gone on. Okay, can we do this? Expertise. Come on. <laughs> Let's see, boys. Let's see. I'm feeling prepared. It's it's gonna give me the value that we crave, that we desire, that we need. All day, every day. Prepared or nothing, baby. 
I dreamed a dream. They're scaling up, guys. I don't know. I gotta kill this guy ASAP. Boom, boom. Okay, carry on. I never thought that I was seeing So different now from how it seems How are we doing it? Oh my god, after image! Ah! Ah! Ah, no, this might be the end. I can see it. Sneaky strike. Nah, nah, nah. So different now from the life I'm living. Ow, I need to kill this guy, but then I need to, like, okay, boom, boom, boom. After image. Ah. Ah. Not good enough. They said two HP was too low. I said, Watch, there's a waffle on this store. Just come watch. Don't believe me, just look. Never mind. Oh, but we got a letter opener. You know, we also got anchor with uh, calipers. We got pantograph. Oh, we can do this with pan. We gotta survive until pantograph, and we can win. But how are we killing the, the champ? They call me a mad lad. Yeah, it's a different story, but that was Act One. We can get it again, right? I think this letter opener. We could potentially win if we get enough repairs. We can just slice the champ to death. Prepared. That doesn't seem. How are we gonna kill the champ? Ah, I have the. Oh, you're right. I think Anchor's gonna help me s save this run. I know Let Opener is really good prepared because I can kill things, and that's really, really, really good. But I think Anchor might save my life. Uh, there's also Dolly's Mirror, so I can duplicate a card. Wait, can I buy Anchor and Dolly's Mirror? I can buy Dolly's Mirror and do it for Adrenaline and prepare, Prepared, right? I can take another Prepared. Now, we just hope we don't get Time Meter. Time Meter, if it, if it happens, it happens, right? So I take another Prepared, and then I get Anchor, right? And then, we're just gonna prepare a lot, a lot, a lot of times to get the tough bandages, and that's be fine. But I think Little is gonna help us... It's pretty clutch, actually. I can pray for damage from no res. Yeah, this is gonna give me damage. Like, if I get enough block, like I just, like we just saw, I'll get damage. So no res would be my damage, and then I just gotta survive this. Let's do this. Never in my life have I done this. Dolly's mirror unprepared. But it's happened. And you know what? We gotta upgrade the next repaired. And, you know, some people look at this and say, 2 HP, you're dead. I say... Think again, buddy. Think again. So different now from the life I'm living. Sorry, I keep singing this song, but like that song got in my head, and now I can't stop singing it. That's a damn good song. If you guys have never heard Susan Boyle sing this, you pe be prepared to cry. And if you don't cry, I don't know you. Never prepared, baby. <laughs> Let's take a look. Let's take a look. If, if I had a letter opener, it would be great, right? But I, I feel like what I made was a more 
like make sure I don't die kind of thing. So that's what I did. Now time meter obviously sucks. We don't want to see that happen. I think dash is just better. Yeah, we get the weaken, but you know, get some damage as well. longer can I do this? You working, Anthony? You're working on the next uh, Battle Royale uh, Slave Spire MOBA? It's gonna be called Slay the Lane. I should actually put cards in no rising. Yeah, but I, I gotta be careful what I put cards in, right? <laughs> I know I should put cards, just... I, I'm being very, uh... Strategic about the cards I put in. AKA... Just give me a second. Actually, while we're here, guys, while we have all this time, right? And we're blurring and doing all these things and terror, we could put terror. How are we killing the champ? Tough bandages is cool, man. Only with tough bandages can you do something like this. Well, what could we get? From, okay, so we can get poison. We can get catalyst, right? We can pick up a catalyst from the. Uh, we can pick up a catalyst from the no rice, right? And then from there we can look for. Um, we can keep picking up a, a lot of blurs and just do that. You know, so the thing about silent, silent has no exhaust cards. We'll do a deadly poison. Not codex. If there's a codex, there's a way to win. Now we just gotta math it out and think to ourselves, okay, so what are we gonna where are we gonna take? Because if there's a codex, there's a way to win. Thousand cuts. That's getting somewhere, but not really though, right? That's not really consistent against the champ. No, a thousand cuts is not the play. I'm thinking some kind of poison thing. So different now. So let's practice. Let's practice a uh, catalyst. Let's practice how th this is the champ fight. This is what we do, right? We, we kind of hold on to the catalyst when we get some poison in. I should do unload for damage. Uh, I'm being a little bit silly. Well, if we get to this point against the champ, um, Calipers is gonna just, yeah, it's gonna be unstoppable. But you gotta be careful how many cards you add, because then you can make your deck less consistent by adding too much, right? So, you wanna keep doing prepared constantly, because that's free block. So you don't wanna add too many random cards. Um, okay, I'll end the fight, though. And we'll see what happens. Alchemize. Alchemize. Well, here's the thing. I think with the champ, I can make a big enough amount of block that it's not going to be a problem. Now, if we get an artifact pot... Ooh. I never thought about farming for uh, potions in this. I mean, how far are we willing to go, guys? By the way, Lies and Ronda Smash and Zoom for Life. Thanks for the follows. Ronda Smash. The other Act 2 boss, there is the Collector, the Champ, and then there is the Hyper Diaper Beam Man. Corpse Explosion is be good here. Corpse Explosion is gonna kill both of them. Easy. Gonna kill both of them. Easy. Bam. Jam. Thank you, ma'am. 
All right. Let's see what's going on with the champ. Noxious Fumes. Noxious Fumes is a way to get some scaling damage against the champ, but I don't like Noxious Fumes because I feel like it's going to prematurely... Uh, it's going to do poison and maybe prematurely proc him when I don't want to, right? I, I want to have full control. I feel like it'll, it, if I'm not ready to split him and, and have Noxious Fumes out, I can't slow it down, you know? Yeah, it's good in theory. I have no rise, so I don't really need to go for Noxious Fumes. Nah, I don't need it. I don't need it because I have no rise. We have Panagraph too, guys, so we have a little bit of like, wiggle, wiggle room. Now, we could do Nightmare to make it cheaper, or we could just upgrade things like... Like Adrenaline. Just to get things going. Because our number one thing is just to get things going. And then, then we're, we're smooth sailing. If we can get Nightmare on that, um... If we can get Nightmare and prepare it again, that would be fantastic. Yeah. I mean, we're already starting off, guys. I mean, it starts off early. And do it, we got it. Bam. Let's go. I mean, guys, we started off early. You think that we're gonna fiddle, fiddle dick around? No, no, no. No, we could do well eight plans for a thousand cuts. Um, I could hold on to a Wraith form for his execute phase. No, I think a thousand cuts would be kind of slow. I'm not ready to do a thousand cuts yet. I'm not worried about damage just yet. Not yet. I do want to get this out of the cycle because my whole goal is actually, you know what? Let's do this. And my goal here is to just kind of uh, make the get a big wall of block, and then then we'll think about damage. Yeah, we're gonna get damage later, don't worry. Um, we wanna find some blurs. The blurs help me get really going. I know this is kinda like Resident Sleeper. But I'm doing what I gotta do, guys, alright? We had 2 HP and we're here. Alright, so no one could tell me otherwise. After image. Ooh. You know what we could do, to be honest? Just farm after image all day. You know what we could do even more so, I just realized, is look for Nightmare, don't play it, and then Nightmare something crazy. That is something. There's a burst. Burst is a little bit awkward. Well, I don't want a Nightmare in Nightmare. Or maybe I do! Maybe that's the smartest thing I've ever heard, and I didn't even think about it. We could do accuracy. We could scale up with accuracy. Wait a minute. And then we could do infinite blades. That is damage. I mean, accuracy is linear increase. Well, we'll, we'll pop a few of those here and there. See what happens. Pop a squat. See what happens. Put that up there. Boom. All right. Got some damage going. Alright, um, see the things, I could pass my turn, but that, I have calipers, so I, I have to continue blocking every single turn. Yeah, it's like, otherwise, fall behind. Ooh, reflex, I mean, if we can, we can craft an infinite deck, right? What if we get a reflex, couple reflex, couple of things? Nah, let's do Wally Plants. Well, he, he's actually getting stronger, too, right? so I gotta be careful. I uh, do need to find a way to do damage. Uh, we haven't found Catalyst yet, though. Oh, I mean, he's getting pretty strong, too. Blur. And there was an accuracy. Damn the accuracy, but blur. We need to find Terror. Alright, we need to play these blurs. We need to find Terror. The blurs can help immensely. 
the blur is gonna help immensely. Yes, sir. Adrenaline. I'm trying to win, man. I am not gonna take this loss. Not after I fucked up that last one, guys. And I had to win, too. I just didn't think about it. You know when you could have had something, but you didn't think? Yeah. That's the worst. Terror. Beautiful. Bom, 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 bom. Alchemize, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the, the terror, do guys, the new YouTube video. Terror debuff war off. Heal hook. Wait, if I get enough heal hooks, can I go infinite? That could be some way to get damage. Let's do a lot of heal hooks, cause he's he's sixteen weaken. So, you know, technically, if I get like 20 heal hooks, it might do something. What do you guys say? Tools of the trade? Eh, it's not bad. Ah, well, the deck doesn't appreciate that language. This deck's brilliant, you're just not seeing it. Guys, I want an artifact. If I can get artifacts, we got these. Ooh. I mean, he's getting strong. But he, I'm trying to scale up a little bit, too. N I'm not scaling up, no, but I mean... He has a long way to go before he's doing some stuff to me. No, but the thousand cuts would be bad because they probably would have put him to the place where he executes me. And then I would have been having a block for the execute. And I'm like, oh no, I'm not ready. Don't attack me. And he's like, brother, I gave you warnings. I'm here to kill you. I'm like, okay, shit. You don't, you don't want to be in that situation. I wish I had more block. I mean, Unseen Tower would be really nice. Accuracy. Accuracy scaling. A little bit, right? We're getting some, some good damage. Yeah, yeah, I know, but I got this because... Okay, you're, you're right. you guys you guys are adamant that Thousand Cuts would have... Okay. Alright. You guys have your opinion. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, just need some heal hooks, guys. We got this. Yeah, I could do Nightmare Accuracy, but then I need to get... I, I'd rather get Nightmare first, because Nightmare's the rare card. Alright guys, let's start going. Let's start unleashing the damage. I think we got this. We got some uh, some accuracies. Got some stuff going for us. An oh, another accuracy. That's the third accuracy. Never that I think I would use accuracy as my way to scale. He's out of control. My name's Seinfeld. Ooh, we got the nightmare, baby. Oh my god, I'm about to see the juiciness. Okay, okay. Okay. What are we got a nightmare, baby? What's it gonna be? Huh? Who's the target? Who's the target? Who's the lucky one? Blade Dance? What if I nightmare a Blade Dance with the accuracies that I have? I could nightmare another prepared. That's kind of crazy and ridiculous. I could nightmare a Wraith form. Wait. I can nightmare a Wraith form and I take so much block already. There's no way I lose. I nightmare a Wraith form. I have so much block as it is. I'll, I'll kill him. Because I, I take my block from tough bandages mostly, so I don't care about dexterity. Can I kill him in 12 turns? That's the question.
Okay, okay, okay. So how about this? We'll do, we'll do blade dance. We'll do blade. Wait, did they nerf ray form? Wait a second. You nerf ray form, Anthony. Anthony, what the? You just sneak that in there? Okay, never mind. Forget about that. Uh, we could do nightmare. We can just save the nightmare for the um for accuracy. Yeah, we'll save it. We'll save it. All right, guys. Okay, we're not. We're, let's not. Let's not. Let's not get carried away. All right. Nightmare actually was a good play. So people have to go to work, so I gotta hurry this up. The people who I gotta go to work. Wait, I can nightmare the heel hook. That's good enough. I can nightmare the heel hook. Yeah, that's good enough. I just gotta get terror again. I wish uh, Silent would have some form of exhaust, but then, then she would be broken. There's a second to terror, right, for the second phase. I'll take that. Um, Alright, that's gonna be for the second phase. We gotta hold on to that. I, I'm, I will not remember the heel hook if I don't get the... Uh, if I don't get, what's it called? Accuracy? I will never heel hook. I start pushing for damage. Alright, so he's about to get to the next phase. Alright, Nightmare Heal Hook, let's do it. I could also Nightmare the, uh... Heal Hook is th such bad damage, guys. It's such bad damage. I would rather do it on a shiv or something, man. But I guess... I guess it's fine. Wait, we have to make sure he's weakened in the future. I will do it. Alright, so we'll save the, um... We'll save the terror for the second phase and the weaken for the second phase, right? So we have terror and the weaken for the second phase. Let's get to the second phase with the heal hook. The ships are so good, guys. Are you guys seeing the damage the ships are doing right now? Are you guys seeing the damage? I want you guys to see Blade Dance. Blade Dance is... is it's nice. That's 28 damage from Blade Dance, guys. Another heal hook. And another one. Alright, so let's try to get some more ships going. Infinite Blades would be fantastic. We're doing it. To think I started off with 2 HP. All right, let's get the weekend, let's get the terror. Oh my god, that's a lot of damage, guys. I don't know about this. Fuck, now that I see it in my face, I'm like, I actually don't know. That's what she said. That is what she said. Uh, I need Blade Dance here. Um, Choke, maybe? Choke might do some damage, right? We gotta do choke. That's greedy, but we gotta do it. I see more blade dance. We got this, man. Blade dance is good. Yeah, we got this. Oh, wait a second. I see it. I see. Oh, that's, that's all my heel hooks. So let's hold on to these two. It's too long for YouTube, dude. I would have to, like, do some major editing for YouTube. Oh, wait. Choke, 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 choke. Chokey, 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 chokey. Yes, 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 yes. 
Double choke. Yes, yes, yes. Give me some prepared. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, baby. That was juicy. I'm getting excited. Slade's probably gets me all excited inside. Where's the Reddit? Choke, choke, choke. Where you at? I mean, who needs choke when you got heel hooks? You know what I mean? What a way to do it. Sure, sure does give me block. Yes, it does. GG. Unload. Well, we had some non-believers in the chat. 2 HP, they said. This is the end, they said. Copy dripper. What a joke. So what do we want here? What do we want here? Guys, I'm talking all this smack. I'm talking all this smack, right? Right? And the moment I press next, time meter's gonna be like, who's laughing now? And Venom? Uh, what's in Venom? What's in Venom for? No point in Venom. You know what I could do? Is it long enough to be YouTube videos? Guys, my YouTube videos are okay. They're long, but not intentionally so. All right. This is how long is this run? Yeah, it's too long. I think Corpse Explosion for Dono and Deca. There you go. Yakety tax. Perfect. That's it. Corpus explosion for Dona and Deca. The problem with Corpus explosion is it doesn't it doesn't exhaust anymore. I actually prefer when it exhausted. Is it just me, or is this effect something that you would rather have exhaust? Am I crazy in this? This is like an execute. When the enemy dies, deal damage to all the enemies. Wouldn't you want this to be one and done? Wouldn't fit very well. Okay, so we got White Beast. Potions, we can look for an artifact. We can do Astrolab and get rid of some of these the strikes. Maybe get some uh, prepared. Alright, let's do artifacts. I mean Astrolab. Couch Ops, not bad. It gets rid of itself. And Venom gets rid of itself. All the attack, yeah, it's not bad. All in all, all I'm seeing here is two powers that get rid of themselves. A smaller deck. If he's not Time Eater... Okay, we have a chance. Now, Donut and Decker, they do scale up pretty heavily. So, Corpse Explosion would be nice. And I'm kind of regretting that, but... Um, we'll see what happens. Alright, we'll see what happens. They do scale pretty heavily. Alright, it's not like the champ. They do scale a lot more than the champ. So, you know, things like a thousand cuts would be really good. We're really looking for like a thousand cuts, I would say. Definitely. Now, I think all attack is not bad to do AoE to both of these. You think they're the easiest? I don't know. I think the Awakened One would be easier, guys. I think the Awakened One would be so easy. Awakened One doesn't scale if I don't play powers. Super easy. How, how is the Donut Deca easier than Awakened One? Explain that to me. Yeah, I played two afters in at because of the champ, but if it was something else, I would figure out a different way. Well, the only powers that I have are Caltrops now, right? But I think I could definitely find a way to make it so that, um... Expertise is not bad. Because we're going to be discarding a lot of cards and drawing. Uh, I'll skip, though. Yeah, I'll do this. Because this might be ice cream, and this could be a way to get skewer or something. But I also got to make sure I don't die, of course. Bum, 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 bum. 
Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, Rayfarm wouldn't have been bad either, I know. A lot of my block comes from not from just discarding, but... Um, I'm trying to think about Dono Deca. We, we have time to think, because these fights take a long time, right? So, Dono and Deca. Alright, so, you know, there's not really any limits about what I can do. I do get days, and that, that days kind of ruins my strategy a little bit, right, guys? So, the longer the fight goes on, the more days I have, the less I'm doing my prepared shenanigans, and, you know, just the more damage I end up taking. Now, we could do things like... No rest can save us. I'm, I'm trying to think what would be the most ideal no rise situation. Okay, so footwork should obviously be really nice. Um, we could get a medkit in the shop. There's footwork would be really nice, of course. We could do things like uh, corpse explosion and some cat. I mean, it's really there's a whole slew of things we can get. If this is ice cream, we can do skewer. Gambling ship, okay. Prepared, okay. Oh my god, prepared plus and gambling ship. Both are really nice. We got the footwork. We have artifact. Now, technically, I could take this artifact, pop the dexterity pot, and I don't care what they're doing. How are they going to kill me with artifact dexterity pot? I mean, dexterity pot. How are they going to kill me? That's five dexterity, plus I play the footwork that I buy. That's seven dexterity. If I upgrade that, that's eight dexterity. I mean, there's also Sneaky Strike, but Sneaky Strike I can get from No Rise. I think the artifact with this is pretty solid. In my opinion. The alternative is to remove a strike. Remove a strike to make the deck even smaller, which makes it more susceptible to dazed. But I think this is better. Noxious Tombs is something that does work in this fight. Noxious Tombs works beautifully. The champ, you don't want to prematurely split him. In this fight, however... You want to just block, block, block until Noxious Shrooms is doing so much that they're choking on themselves, right? So, that is something I would take. And if I get that offer to no rise, 100% taking that. I could have bought it there, I just... I went for the artifact instead. I'm not sure if that was the, the best play. But, uh, yeah. Noxious Shrooms is definitely a win condition. Easily. Easily. Corpse Explosion. Hey, Corpse Explosion beautiful for this. Yeah, ar Artifact Plus with Double Dex is enough. But here's the thing, though. Uh, and I need to ask Anthony this. The Corpse Explosion is fantastic here. Uh, that guy's the most HP. That's GG. So, Anthony. If I pop both Dex 30 Pots and then... The way I think it works, though, is I think the moment I pop the Speed Pot, it takes rid of the Artifact, right? So I need two Artifact Potions. Rather. So I, I can only get 5 dexterity. Okay, got it. But in the past, though, it was possible to um, to get like 10 dexterity from one artifact, right? Or am I thinking something wrong? Oh. Gambling chip. Gambling chip. Hello. That's good. That's pretty good. No, because of, because the artifact is already on me. Like if I so if I had like an artifact potion, I could do both of these and then the artifact potion. But because of the way that this works, it's a little bit different. I just remembered it was different in the past. Footwork or cow traps? Uh. No, I know, I know, but if you have an artifact potion, you can use it after the fact. Nightmare Adrenaline. Yep, there's no choice here. Ah, Panache. Panache is fantastic. How do I forget about Panache, man? That's so genius. P 
Panache is such a genius, easy solution. Unfortunately, I can't get Panache out of uh, Mill Rise. I can't get Magnetism either. So I need to find Magnetism or Panache. Letter Opener would have been good too, actually. Letter Opener would have been pretty fantastic. But I, I'm happy that I didn't take Letter Opener. I mean, I don't know, maybe I should have taken Letter Opener. I think the champ fight would have been harder without it. What did Duck recommend? Duck recommended getting Unload. He started off this whole thing. He put me onto the idea like, wait, yeah, I do have... I do have a lot of, uh, discard. And here we are. But I think, because I was only at 2 HP, the anchor was like, worst case scenario, because I got lucky with the event. So, because I had 2 HP, I was like, the anchor, I think, was the less, the least variance. Tough to say, though. Tough to say. How's my first experience with this game? Pretty well, man. I think I did pretty well. Like, I, I did lose the first couple runs or whatever, but I, I think I. Uh, had an act for this game pretty uh, relatively quickly. Because I've always liked card games. Dodge and roll is going to be perfect with dexterity. I've loved card games, man. So in total, we have 7 plus 3. We have 10 dexterity. That should be enough. Um, yeah, that should be enough. That should be enough. We can even do cow traps, and they're they're taking ten damage a turn with cow traps. So that's something that's like not, that's not paltry. There's also I can also just get something like crazy here. That's stupid. I can go immediately to the boss. I'd rather not. <laughs> Why would I give up these things? Regal pillow. <laughs> Healthy know that sleep is for the week. I got coffee. We dripping coffee. Catalyst. No, the, so the, basically the the pillow is just yeah, it's just like a little. Uh, it's a holder for my coffee dripper, or something. Nightmare catalyst. If we can do that against the boss, I'm not. I'm not opposed to it. We definitely like the noxious fumes. The portal usually worth it? I don't know, man. I I took a portal once and I was like, this was way harder than it should have been. I think the portal is kind of a little dodgy. Take the portal at your own risk. Second relic is tough bandages. He's actually holding up on my block. I'm I'm having some trouble keeping up with this dude. And so that's her, of course. You get three block every time you discard a card. It's crazy, I know. It's nuts. It does sound like the right deck. Yes, it does. It maths out. <laughs> Catalyst, baby. It's coming to life. Obviously, it's easy to like do that in a no-pressure fight like this, but uh.
footwork again. All right, so we're looking at 13 dexterity in this boss fight. That's more than enough to find a win condition. Shame. Dodge and roll. It's not bad with all the dexterity I'm about to have. Let's just throw that out there. Um, Noxious Fumes. Oh my god, can you imagine if I had Tinksha? Shit, that would have been something. And Noxious Fumes as well. Do I want to get a uh, backflip? Maybe. Alright, we're just going to be blocking all day. I don't know about this. That's just going to take Dreadland so we can get going. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to do the uh, Speed Pot. Boom. Dexterity pot. Boom. Footwork. Boom. That's 10 dexterity. Bam. That's 13 dexterity. We got everything in the first turn. We are off for the races. Now, now we gotta search for the, the win condition. We got dodge and rolls. I mean, pretty ideal. Alright? Pretty ideal. After image. Okay. After image is kind of bad compared to dodge and roll, actually. But after image is a passive thing, so that's nice. And Venom is not bad. I will take that. Give me some uh, infinite blades, baby. Alchemize. You know, Stormer Steel is not bad because it does give me in Venom. But Alchemize could be. Let's do Stormer Steel. Actually, Stormer Steel is like awkward because. Okay, so Couch Ops is really good. Alright. And Stormer Steel is pretty awkward, actually. But Caltrops is fantastic. That's 10 damage reflects. Terror is very good. Gotta be careful for the days, of course. Terror is fantastic. Do not want to get rid of that. Alright, let's do leg sweep. Adrenaline. Okay, okay. Corpse Explosion would be fan- If I get Corpse Explosion while this guy's close to his death, that's just gonna be... Glorious. I shouldn't be on getting rid of the days like that. Double Weaken, that's fine. What about Nightmare? Nightmare on Adrenaline? Or Nightmare Prepared, right? But then that's bad for days. It's pretty bad for days, actually. Dodge Roll is like 34 block in total, but this is pretty good damage. Nice mm, stuff to say, man. Let's do that. Storm of Steel. I shouldn't be getting rid of the dust. We talked about this. I should be playing dodge roll on cooldown. We got Catalyst, okay. Um... Got Malaise. It's pretty damn good. I'd rather get the, uh, the, the draw. <sighs> you think it's GG already? I don't know, man. I don't know about that. The days are pretty bad. I don't know, I don't know if it's GG just yet. Another in Venom versus Malaise. Dagger Spray's not bad, right? I 
I think we just show much through here, guys. After image. Okay. So we're gonna have to contend with 19 strength. Now that doesn't mean that we can't like we can't get um like we could we could possibly get we could possibly get malaise. It's actually pretty good. Close the trade is fine. I know I won, okay, I'm finishing it, dude. I know I won. I still gotta win it. Like, I can't just be like, okay, I won. Uh, give me the win. I have still to win it. I'm just, like, talking through things. I know, I, I see that I won. Like, I, I'm, I'm a believer now. I see it. I see the victory. I'm just talking through things. I'm going for the win, and just my deck is slow. I mean, okay, I, I, I'm striking as much as I can. I don't have that much attacks. I'll find them. I'll find them and I'll play them. S. G. West. Are you trolling me right now? Are you trolling me? I didn't get any. I didn't think I got any blur in this fight. Beautiful. Who was the first boss again? That took a while. I did. GG.